Let's go to your voicemails. 2192 David P is the number. Here is a voicemail questioning the Eggman's involvement in this show. Take a listen. Hi, David. This is Eric. Um, I recently became a viewer of your show, and I really enjoy it. It's a refreshing, uh, progressive uh, news. But I wanted to ask you why the Eggman is on your show so much. Um, <laughs> it's not that I don't find it interesting or entertaining. It's just, yeah. it's, uh, I don't know, it's just kind of strange. Yeah. All right, see you later. It is weird. It's weird to us, too, that the Eggman is part of this show, Lewis, uh, uh, on, on occasion. But it's only like once every 10 days or so that we play one of his voicemails. However, this is very cool. Steve sent me a bit of a commercial from Canada. It's like a public service announcement about for farmers, for dairy farmers. And he suggested it could be the Eggman's new theme. I've taken the key part. Let's listen. And you tell me. I open it to the audience. Should this be the Eggman's theme? It's very short, but it could be the Eggman's new theme, Lewis. Do you like it? I like it. I think I think we should keep it, and I think the Eggman is, is here to stay. I like it. All right. Although lately, the Eggman getting very negative reviews for his comments on any number of compelling subjects on the show. Here's one more voicemail for you. Hi, Dave Gordon here. Um, I was going to say that you you said on the, the December 13th show that you like uh, the moons of Jupiter, and right. you didn't know why. It's probably <laughs> an auspicious configuration in your astrology chart right. that's making you like it, and that's probably the reason a competent astrologer could probably find that. You just tell them that you have a, a, a liking for Jupiter moons, and uh, they could probably give you a definitive answer, um, one that really clicks. Yeah, I'm not sure about that. Gordon Lewis is an instant all-star. I mean, it's instant classic. I think he already has three instant classic voicemails. I didn't say I didn't know why I liked the moons of Jupiter. What I said was, I've always been interested in the moons of Jupiter because they play a prominent role in some Arthur C. Clarke books. So it's not, I don't think, an astrology type thing, Lewis. It's just because of those books I've read. I don't know. There could still be some connection there, David. You can't dismiss that completely. <laughs> All right, excellent bonus show today. We will talk about China landing on the moon. A 93-year-old Florida mayor is looking for his 20th term in office and much more. Get the bonus show with our year-end membership special. This is so huge. You get the one-year membership. You get a David Pakman show zip-up hoodie made from 100% recycled materials shipped to you for free if you live in the U.S. And you get a David Pakman show bumper sticker not available for uh, available for sale anywhere. Plus, you and every other active member in good standing as of December 31st will be entered into our drawing, which will happen in early January, either for an Apple iPad or a Microsoft Surface. We haven't yet decided which it will be, but if you're a member by December 31st, you are in the drawing and you could win. You have to go to davidpackman.com slash 2014 here to sign up. That's the only website, davidpackman.com slash 2014 here to get the extras. We will talk to you today on The Bonus Show.